you are you are a series of overlapping informed fields but you can tap into the very informed field around you and this is best done not in not amidst architecture although it can be done amidst architecture i don't want to sound too metaphysical but i'm telling you if i was living in ancient times i would be a druid there is nothing that can channel mental mental power true spiritual power more than tying yourself into the informed field of a tree and a tree that is surrounded by many many other trees because its root systems will be interlocked with the root systems of other trees and it will go for a long all through the minerals all throughout the root systems of all the plants in the forest that tree has its own informed field that tree is surrounded by informed fields that tree is a part of a larger field that is the forest that forest is a part of a larger field of the surrounding environs we don't even if you don't even know what's underground there could be 400 feet below you a mineral rich river rapidly running beneath that forest you don't know what's below you there is more areas to discover underground than there is on the surface of this world we only live on a thin biosphere that's 12 miles six miles to the highest peak six miles down to the lowest part of the marianas trench that's a 12 mile biosphere and you can't even breathe but in a narrow strip of that biosphere now that'll change under a vapor canopy but right now that's how it is we can go down underground for miles as long as we have air down there and we can build cities vertically we don't well we don't on the surface we got to build out because we can't build but so far up and you can only go so far down but when you're way deep in the earth, you can build in 360 degree sphere in any direction you want to and just keep going. There can be more cities and populations underground than there ever was on the surface.